Finkel Sheets. Hello and welcome. I am Dr. Friedrich Finkel Sheets, and today we will be talking about aliens. Some people say aliens do not exist, but those people are cuckoo. Not like me. I am not cuckoo. Look, do I look like a cuckoo bird? Go! I don't do that. I am a rational man. And if aliens do not exist, then how do you explain this? This is an actual alien that crashed in Roswell, New Mexico. As you can tell by his big black eyes and silly little antennae that don't do anything at all. He came here in his little UFO. Now what is a UFO, you ask? Well, I will tell you. A UFO is an unidentified flying object that flies around like Kind of. This, this is a bowl. This is a bad example. I need a better, better example. This, yes, yes, yes. This is a better example of a flying saucer. This is the cockpit. This is the body. And these are maracas. There are not maracas on the real spaceship. This is a child's balloon for parties. And it is also proof that Mexicans are aliens from outer space. Yes. Oh, ooh, this is more, 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 more evidence. Pop rocks. Pop rocks were invented by the aliens. I, I will show you. Now listen closely, you you hear the popping, that is alien technology at work, yes, double sided tape, it is sticky on both sides, human minds could not think of this, alien technology, now you may be asking yourself, you may be asking yourself finger shits, how do I communicate with these aliens, I will show you, whoa, fake, it's so fake, what, guys, guys, that's not fake, that's a real alien! Come on, Junior, are you serious? Yeah, it's just a dumb sci-fi show. No, that's a real alien on that table. Dr. Finkelshitz knows what he's talking about. No, he doesn't, no, dude. Dr. Finkelshitz is not even a real doctor. He's he using a Mexican balloon. Yeah. He's a real doctor! You see the glasses and the lab coat? That's a real, that's real doctor hair. Junior, it's just TV. No, that's a real alien. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. This is how you must stress when you are communicating with the alien. Now, where did the alien go? So I did not press like a hot dog for no reason. The alien must have been upset that I had the pop rocks and he disappeared. That is the only explanation for... Ah! 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 Oh, no, no, God! Oh, Dr. Finkel, shit, no! Junior, calm down. It's just a TV show. Yeah, Junior. It's not just a TV show. That alien is hurting Dr. Finkel, shit. We need to save him. Junior, it's an old show from the 1950s. No, he's not an yeah, old show. And that alien isn't even real, dude. The alien is clearly real. Look at that. That's a real alien. No. I, I need a hot dog outfit. What? what? I, need a hot, I need to talk to an alien. I need a hot dog outfit. Junior. That's not going to work, Junior. It worked for Dr. Finkel, shit. He's wearing a hot dog outfit. I need a hot dog outfit. Um, Junior, I need you to take out the trash for me. What? Excuse me? Take out the trash? Since yeah. when? What do you mean? It's your chore. You only have one chore. What? I'm washing dishes right now, and I need you to take out the trash. Well, take out the tr uh, 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 uh. It's, uh, it's dark outside. I, I might get kidnapped, right? Oh, man, that would be so lucky for me. But look, nobody wants to kidnap you, Junior. But Just take out the trash and hurry back, okay? Uh, uh, hurry, hurry. Uh, guys, guys, uh, uh, y'all go with me, right? No, it's dark. It's scary. Well, yeah, it's, it's cold outside, dude. Uh, cold. Y'all guys are wimps. You know what? Y'all can suck a butthole. And I bet you have butt cheeks with pimples on them and stuff. Maybe. That was rude. Uh, <laughs> Get ready to take out the trash, Junior. You know what, Chef Pee Pee? What? I hope your cat gets feline leukemia. What? I don't even have a cat, Junior. Well, I hope you get a cat. And you fall in love with it. And you love it every night. And then it gets feline leukemia. What the hell is your problem? Ew, 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 ew. Ew! Oh, I hate taking out the trash. It's so disgusting. Ew! Hey, man. Ah! Oh, who, 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 who are you? Hey, hey you, you having to change, little man? Or uh, cheeseburger. Uh, ch or change? I, I, uh, no, I, I don't carry change on me. I'm, I'm poor. Oh, me too. Oh, well, oh that's a nice hat. Why, why do you have tinfoil on your head? Oh, there's so the aliens can't read my thoughts. Well, yeah. Aliens? You believe in aliens? Oh well, yeah, man. They took me up in their spaceship and their, their flying saucer. Well, they took you in a flying saucer? Yeah, and they tried to read my thoughts and probe things up my butthole. And, uh, Whoa! Uh, Wait, so so yeah. do aliens exist, right? Oh, of course they exist, man. Oh, that'd be so cool to go up inside a flying saucer with the aliens. Oh, it's bad, man. They put things in your butt and uh, do they, all kinds of things. They put stuff in your butt? Yeah, and they try to well, read your thoughts. Well, man. Well, my friends don't believe in aliens. They're stupid, right? Oh, yeah. Hey, aliens are real, man. You, you don't let nobody tell you otherwise. And man. school's stupid, too, right? Uh, I mean, yeah, I dropped out. I don't even... Yeah, and look at you. You're a winner. Yeah, I came out great, man. <gasps> well, it's nice meeting you, homeless man. I'm going to go talk to my friends about aliens. You do that. That hobo was right. Aliens are real. He was abducted by aliens. And... Huh? Is that 
a UFO? A UFO? <laughs> guys! Guys, 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 guys! <laughs> There's a UFO outside right now! Come on, come on, come on! Wait, 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 wait. What? What? Junior, what? are you sure you didn't see a plane? Yeah. No, it's not a plane! What, what, what did it look like? It's, it's, it's a light in the sky, uh -huh. and it's going really slow, and yeah. it's flashing, it's going to yeah, blink. Yeah, it's a plane, Junior. It's yeah. not a plane, it's a UFO! Come look, come look! Fine. Okay. Hey, hey, guys, it was right there, right there, right there. Dude, I don't yeah. even see anything. Yeah, I don't see anything, Junior. What, what, where'd it go? Junior, no. are you sure it's not because it's a plane? It, it was not a plane, it was a UFO flying saucer. Dude, right. it could be a plane, are you yeah. sure? No, it was a UFO, I swear, guys, it was a UFO. It was a... <gasps> what about that? That's a star, Junior. Yeah. You've a, seen stars before. A star? Dude, dude it's getting no. cold, I'm going this Guys, I promise it was a UFO. I, I saw it. I did, I... Oh, 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 that was a UFO! Guys! <sighs> guys, 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 it's another UFO! I promise! It's outside right now! It just blew over my head! Come on, guys! Junior, it's probably just another plane. No, 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 the first one was possibly a plane. This one was a UFO. It's a flying saucer. It had a light underneath it. It blew over my head. I saw it with my own eyes! Junior, what are the odds that you would see a UFO on the same night that we're watching a show about aliens? Yeah, what? think about it, dude. Yeah, Cody does have a point. Your mind's just playing tricks on you. No, I saw it with my own eyes. It flew over my head. I saw it. It had a light. There's aliens! Aliens! It says it's real! Are you sure it wasn't a street light or anything? It, it yeah. was not a street light. It was a UFO! Junior, stop all that yelling! You're making the neighbors mad, and you need to take your ADHD medicine and go to bed. Never! I'm never taking my ADHD medicine ever again! I never take it! Every time I take it, I hide it under my tongue and I spit it in the trash can! I've never taken it! That, that explains a lot, actually. Oh, shit, BB! I saw a UFO outside, and they won't believe me. They're saying it's an airplane, but it was a flying saucer! It flew over my head, a light was coming out! It was real, shit, BB! It probably was an airplane! There's no such thing as It was not an airplane! The hobo was, was telling the truth! What, what? The aliens are real! They probed his butt! What? What? what the hell are you talking about, Junior? Shut up, baby. Aliens are real. I saw a UFO. You believe me, right? You need to stop watching this TV show you're watching. Okay? No, no, I'm never stopping watching Finkel shit. What? I want to watch more Finkel shits. It, it ended about ten minutes ago. What? Really? Yeah, yeah. After the alien attacked him, he didn't come back. So it's time for you to go to bed, Junior. So go and get in your bed, okay? Okay, Shuppy. Fine. Well, I'll go to bed. Hmm. Y'all are gonna stay the night, right, guys? I, I, I'm, I'm afraid of aliens. So... Yeah, I don't have any parents. Yeah, I'm DTF. Okay, so y'all gonna stay the night? Yeah. Okay, guys. Oh, oh man, I'm really scared that aliens are gonna break in and probe my butt. Dude, that, that won't make me happy at all, right? That, that made me kind of happy. <laughs> huh. Well, anyway, let's go to sleep, guys. Okay. Oh, guys, I'm not ready to go to sleep yet. I am. Cody, I can't sleep. I'm too busy thinking about aliens. Junior, you just saw a plane. You'll be fine. I did not see a plane. I mean, it could have been a plane the first time. The second time, definitely a UFO. Yeah, it's just your imagination. No, 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 no. The homeless man with the tinfoil hat by the dumpster said that he got abducted by aliens and they went through his butt. Uh, Junior, the, 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 the homeless man by the dumpster in the tinfoil hat? Yes. Really? Yes. He sounds like a real credible guy. Real yeah. wealth of information. He knew what he was talking about. I could see it in his eyes and yeah, his beard. Yeah. <sighs> Oh, okay, okay, Cody. Well, you believe in aliens somewhere, right? Well, yeah, I think there's probably aliens out there somewhere, but they're definitely not little green men like you see on TV. Men. Okay, well, um, what do you think they look like? Well, I don't know. They're probably, like, gray and slimy. Gray? They're green, Cody! They're okay. not gray and slimy. I'll ask Joseph. Would... Joseph, what do you think aliens look like? Dude, I don't know. I don't care. Leave me alone. What's wrong with Joseph? Well, he's probably still just lonely after his parents died. Uh, uh, we're Why are about... you laughing at my dead parents? We're not laughing at your dead parents. We're laughing about aliens. Stop no, no, you brought up my dead parents. Why are you laughing? Why are you always bring up your dead parents? We don't care. They it died. still hurts. Get over it. They died. No, no come back. Sleep. Shut up. Jeez. Yeah. We're not even talking about your dead parents. We're talking about aliens. Okay, Cody. So what planet do you think they live on? Uh, I don't know. Probably some planet we've never heard of. Like Zablorbin clocking? Z yes, Zablorbin Clocken. I bet that's it. You got it on the first guess, Junior. Y yes, that's the name of the planet, Zablorbin Clocken. I'm going to sleep, Junior. Go going to sleep? Oh, one more question, one more question. Okay, what? What type of clothes do you think aliens wear? I don't know, Junior. How about sunglasses and uh, Crocs? D Crocs? Yes. Really? Crocs. They mastered faster than light travel and they're still wearing Crocs. Yes, because Everyone they're... else stopped in 2004, but they're still going strong. They're fashionable. <sighs> Whatever, Junior. I'm going to sleep. But don't, don't go to sleep. What if the aliens come and get me? The aliens? They're out there somewhere. They're out there somewhere. They're gonna come get me in their flying saucer.
Oh, what's that light? Cody, turn it off. Junior, go back to sleep. What? There's an alien. There's an alien on the, on the, on the side of the bed. No aliens, Junior. There's a one. There's an alien over there. It just went underneath the bed. Junior, what is that light? It's gonna give me a seizure. Ugh. It's the, it's the alien. It's the alien's light. What, Junior? Joseph, Joseph, Joseph. Oh, dude, my parents are dead. Wait. Hey. Have you been asleep yet? No, I haven't been asleep. Have, did, did, you, did you see the alien? Dude, who cares? Cody, Cody, it was an alien. Oh, and that light right there. That was a real alien, though, right? Well, you're the real alien. It's a real alien, but where'd he go? Where'd he go? <laughs> <laughs> what do you want? What do you want? What, what do you want with me? I'm not so for you. I'm so for you. <laughs> me? Well, what do you want from me? You spoke to the homeless man behind a dumpster. I know too much. I, I, I know too much. But all he told me was about was aliens and, uh, and, and, and anal probing. You you yeah. you, you probe butts, right? You no, we do that for fun. You guys probe butts? Yeah. That's cool. Wow. But anyway, I mean, what are you gonna do to me? Yeah. What are you gonna do to me? I'm gonna wipe your mind. Well, well I mean, if you if you wipe my mind, you have to wipe Cody's. Cause, yeah, I mean, cause he... We, we saw you, and, and and Joseph saw you, and your, your spaceship's in the parking lot down there. And those lights are like waking up oh, the whole yeah. neighborhood. I so. left the blinkers on. The blinker, but yeah. they're really they're annoying. Right. But but no, you don't have to wipe yeah, my yeah. mind. We won't I'm tell anyone. Wipe all the minds right now. Wait, no, 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 we have questions. We have questions. We have questions. We never get to meet aliens. So um, yeah, I'm, I'm like like, what's your home planet yeah, called? Yeah. My home planet is known as the Bubble Crackle. Ha! What? Ha, Cody! What are the odds? I was right. I was right. I, alien, I uh, guess that. I guess it. I said the Bubble Crackle is a definitely a planet uh, name. Good for you. Uh, what type of shoes do y'all wear? Man, I wear Crocs. Crocs! You cannot have been right about it. Crocs. The most fashionable thing since right? 2004. It's fashion, ridiculous. fashion, oh, fashion. God. Do y'all like hot dogs? Man, I love hot dogs. The Fickle uh, Shit is right! You know, Fingle Shit! Yeah, Fickle Shit has his own TV show. You know, everyone wow. thinks he's cuckoo, but he's not cuckoo. Uh, he's that not man cuckoo. Is cuckoo. Uh, yeah, so. What else? Uh, um, uh, the, the, the uh, sun's uh, a uh, wait, may, Maybe you can settle something for us. So. Uh, um, uh, okay, you're from space, so is the sun a planet or not? No, nah, my parents live on the sun. Yes! 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 No, yes! 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 No, yes! No, yes! Yes! No, no, yes! 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 now back to Dr. Finkelschitz. Hello and welcome. I am Dr. Friedrich Finkelschitz, and today we will be talking about aliens. Crunch Master. Need a little crunch in your day? Crunch, yeah you do. Take a crunch and break with the world's crispiest, crunchiest gluten-free snack. Crunch Master. Discover the crunch you crave in the deli and with the better for you snacks. So guys, what do you want to do today? Well, today's my birthday. I don't know, dude. What do you want to do? I don't know. I'm bored. You want to play board games? Uh, nah, that's boring, dude. Today's my birthday. We should do something fun. Yeah, you want to ask Cody what he wants to do? Yeah, let's do that. Today's my birthday, though. All right, let's ask Cody. Okay. Today's my birthday. Cody, what do you want to do today? I want to celebrate my birthday. Oh, oh cool. When is it? It's today. Well, today's your birthday? Well, yeah, that's what I've been saying. You should have just said something. I did several times. You did? Yeah. Well, well how old are you turning? I'm 12. F12! F the police! F the pigs! Hmm. Yeah. Oh, well, what do you want to do for your birthday? Uh, I don't know what to do, Junior. We should do something really fun. Okay, like what? Uh, let's watch TV. Oh, how exciting. Are you cool? Then you need to come to the coolest party ever, Chuck E. Cheese, after dark. You can turn up with the one and only Charles Entertainment Cheese and experience an all-new type of ball pit. Come now. Must be 10 years or older to enter. Bring your ID. Whoa! We should totally go to that. Oh, yeah, dude. It looks so awesome. Yeah, that's the perfect place to go. Yeah, we should go tomorrow. Oh, yeah, dude. Or today. 
Why would we go today? Well, because today is it's Saturday and we don't have school tomorrow. Oh yeah, dude, we can stay there all night. Yeah, we can stay there all night. Woo, woo, woo. Yeah, but today is also my birthday. Oh yeah, you, you did just tell us that. Oh, dude, I totally forgot. Yeah, we can celebrate you turning 12. Man, F12, he's probably wearing a wire, snitch. All right, Joseph, you're acting absolutely ridiculous. One more outburst like that and you're going home. Oh, dude, I'm sorry. Maybe I'm overreacting. Maybe I'm overreacting. Yeah, yeah. So anyway, we can go celebrate your birthday, Cody, because you're turning to... You're, you're turning that age. Yeah. Yeah, we're, I mean, you have to be 10 years and up, right? And, and I'm 11, and Joseph's 11, mm -hmm. and you're 12. Man, if... All right, all right, I'm going to calm down. I'm going to calm down. All right, so everyone grab your IDs, and let's go to Chuck E. Cheese. All right. Okay. Oh man, guys, I can't wait for this party! Yeah, hey, dude. hey, IDs, I gotta see your IDs to make sure you're 10 or older. Oh, guys, you got your IDs? Uh, yeah! Oh, hey, Roy, what's up, my man? Go on in. What, you didn't ID Roy? Oh, come on, dude, it's Roy Gidhart. He doesn't need an ID. He can get to the Super Bowl without a ticket if he needed to. But he had a ticket, but he didn't pay for it, I'll tell you that much. Okay, well, um, here's my ID. Uh, let's see here. Uh, you're 11 years old. All right, go on in. Awesome! Here's my ID. Let's take a look. Yeah, you're 11, go on in. Mm -hmm. right, here's mine. Uh, let's see. Ooh, no, sorry, kid. It says right here you're three years old. But no, I'm not. I'm 12. Well, well, what's the problem? He says I can't get in because I'm three years old. Well, how's he three years old? Well, he was born on February 29th, and there's only been three of those since 2008, so he's three years old. What? You're three years old, Cody? No, I'm 12. Well, sorry, kid. You can't get in. Yeah, that sucks, Cody. We'll see you back at my house. But, 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 guys! What? Sorry, kid. You're gonna have to get off the property. <laughs> No, they wouldn't let me in. I'm not three years old. I just want to go to Chuck E. Cheese. Man, Joseph, that was the coolest party ever. Dude, I know. Look at all these tickets. Oh, I know, and look at my squishy Chuck E. Cheese head. Oh, dude, look at my laser gun. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, dude, it's awesome. But guys, you went without me. What? Cody, why didn't you go? Well, I tried, but they wouldn't let me in. Why wouldn't they let you in? Because they thought I was three years old. Junior, you were standing right next to me when it happened. Well, are you three years old? No, I'm 12. Man, F12. I swear to God, if I see 12, I'm going to bust a cap in their butt like, mm, die, bitch, uh, die. Uh, all right, Joseph, ah! all right, Joseph, Joseph, go home. What? Yeah, go home. You're, that's it. You're kicked out of the video. Really? Yeah, I gave you, I gave you one Come last on. warning. Get out. Can, can I get a ticket, show? Yeah, take the ticket. You're gone. That's it. No. Um, Unacceptable. Unacceptable. <sighs> I'm sorry about that, Cody. Yeah, he needed to go. Yeah, he did. So what? You're three years old or something? But no, I'm not three years old, Junior. I'm 12. Okay, then why'd they think you were three years old? Okay, Junior, look. I was born on February 29th. Now, that day has only happened three times since I've been born. So technically, I've only ever had three birthdays. Okay, so you're three years old. That makes sense. No, Junior. I'm 12. Then why haven't you had 12? birthdays. Well, Junior, look, the important thing is that I don't want to be born on February 29th. Well, the only thing you can do is go back in time and stop yourself from being born on that day. Well, I guess I could get a cardboard box and write time machine on it and make it into a time machine. Well, let's do that. All right, I'll be right back. I'm going to the UPS store. Okay. Behold, Junior, the t -t time machine. T -t 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 time machine. T -t 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 Time machine, t -t 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 patent pending. Whoa, a time machine! What's it do? Well, it's a time machine, Junior. It lets you travel forward and backward in time. Okay, so this is what I was thinking. I think we should go back in time to the day before your parents boinked and make them boink on that day so that you're born a day before. Oh, that's a good idea. I didn't even think of that. Okay, so how do we do it? Uh, well, you gotta put a quarter in it. What, uh, a quarter? Yeah, well, I figured if I was gonna make a time machine, I might as well make a little bit of money off of it. Well, now we have to pay a quarter. I don't even have a quarter. Well, I have one quarter, but we have to get this right on the first try. Okay, well, put it in. Okay. Okay, so what day do we have to go? Like nine months before you were born? Uh, so that would be May 28th, 2007. Yeah, yeah, so, so nine months and one day before you were born. Yeah, okay. Uh, so May 28th, 2007. Um, uh, well, Junior, those buttons don't work. They're just bits of paper. Oh. Yeah. Uh, okay, well, we just get in it? Yeah, yeah, just, just count it. Uh, okay. Pew, 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 all right, Cody, we're here. We're at your parents' house on May 28th, 2007. We just have to make your parents do it today instead of tomorrow. But, Junior, how are we going to make my parents do it? <sighs> just leave that up to me, Cody. Good night, Tyrone. I really hope robbers don't break in and kill us in our sleep. Oh, nah, baby. The good Lord wouldn't let that happen. Plus, my cousin already locked up. Hey, hey, baby. You want to fool around a little bit? Oh, not tonight, Tyrone. I have diarrhea. Oh, come on, baby. So now I know you're lying because that hasn't stopped us before. No means no, Tyrone. Don't make me write a Me Too tweet. All right, all right, you're right. I got to respect your wishes as a woman. Your body, your choice. Oh, Tyrone, you're so sexy and hot. Uh, have me right now. 
Oh, baby, you changed your mind? No, Tyrone, I said no, and that's final. Come on, baby, you must be bipolar or something, because I heard something totally different. Tyrone, don't make me call the police. All right, all right, God. Oh, Tyrone, I changed my mind. I want to do it right now. Oh, baby, you can have me. Get <laughs> off of me, Tyrone. I'm calling the cops. That's it. Baby, we married. All right, you're coming with me, and you're going to jail for a long time. Yeah, that's right. Lock him up. But, baby, I'm sorry. No means no, Tyrone. Now you have fun rotting in jail. Oh, God. Come. Junior, you got my dad arrested? I was just trying to make him do it. But my mom had diarrhea. Oh, so she's not going to have diarrhea tomorrow when they do it? Well, no, I guess not. And now they're not going to do it tomorrow because my dad's in jail, and now I'll never even even be born. Okay, okay, how about we go to May 29th, the day they did it, and we stop them from doing it. Uh, yeah, I guess that would be easier. All right, let's get in the time machine and go to May 29th. Okay. Well, we need a quarter. Ah, uh, dang it. Um, is there a quarter around here? Oh, oh look, look, look what's behind your ear. Whoa! Yeah, okay. Let's go. Okay, we're here on May 29th. Let's stop your parents from doing it. Okay, but try not to get anyone arrested this time. No one's gonna get arrested. So, Tyrone, my diarrhea is all cleared up and I'm ready to go. Oh, oh baby, you know how to get me there. <laughs> oh, and we ran out of toilet paper, too. Oh, don't tease me now. Don't tease me. <laughs> oh, Tyrone, I'm here. You sent me a picture of your sausage and you told me to come taste it. What, Tyrone, who is this woman? Baby, I have never seen this woman in my entire life. Well, that's what you said about the last few women who walked into our room. Okay, okay, on oh, God, I've cheated on you three times. Three different women. She ain't one of them. What are you talking about, Tyrone? We've been seeing each other for years now. You said you love me. Oh, I think I see what's going on here. Huh? You want a menage a trois, okay? What, 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 what that mean? Well, that means me and her together. Okay, yeah, yeah, that's what I want. I, I want that. <laughs> yeah, come on, join us. No, 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 no. He, he said he said he just wanted me by myself, just me and him, not his ugly wife. He called you ugly. What? No, no I ain't say that, baby. Uh, I wanted the uh, thing you asked for, the menage a trois. Oh, okay. Well, come on. Hop in. Yeah, come on, come on. No, no. He didn't want a menage a twig. He, want, he wanted one twig. He wanted me. He wanted me to have his. He, he, he just wants me by myself. Well, Tyrone, I don't understand. How about we just start and then she can join if she wants to? Whoa, no, no, baby. no, no, no. Don't do it. Don't do it. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Tyrone. Oh, baby, Judah. Sorry, Cody, I couldn't stop him. Junior, you could have just taken one for the team. You know what? Give me the wig. I'll do it. Cody, it's not worth it. Junior, I don't want my birthday to be on February 29th. I want to go to Chuck E. Cheese. Cody, it's not worth getting with your parents to go to Chuck E. Cheese. Yes, it is. I want to go. Cody, look, I got a better idea. How about we go to the day you were born and we stop your mom from giving birth until March 1st? What? How are we supposed to stop her, Junior? Uh, I don't know. Distract her? What? Distract her from childbirth. Well, tell her to hold it in like holding in a poop. What? I'm not a poop, Junior. I'm a baby. I know you're a baby. You're three years old and you act like all the time. What? Okay, fine, Junior. We'll try your idea. Yes, yeah, so let's go to February 29th, 2008, and stop your mom from giving birth until March 1st. Okay, fine. We need another quarter. Uh, hold on. There's probably one in the couch cushions. Oh, yeah. Okay, here's one. All right, put it in. All right, let's go. And pew, 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 All right, Cody, we're here. February 29th, 2008. Now I just have to stop your mom from giving birth. Well, how are you going to do that, Junior? Just watch and learn, Cody. Watch and learn. Oh! Push, baby, push! Oh! Hold on. I think I see the head. Yeah, it's definitely a girl. We have a baby girl? Oh, what, the baby? Oh, I have no idea. But doctor, doctor, it's an emergency. We need you in the emergency room. Stat, someone has coronavirus. What, what is that? Oh, oh I, I forgot. It's, it's 2008. Uh, some kid was running down the stairs with scissors. Oh, no. Yeah, and he had two pairs of scissors. Oh, both eyes? Both eyes. Oh, man, you hate to see it. So they need you in there to operate stat. But, but I'm delivering this baby. Well, what's it here, fish breath? We need you right now in the emergency rooms. Look, I'll take over. Okay, but have fun. All right, ma'am, I need you to listen to me. Oh, I, I know, I'm already pushing. Well, no, 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 I need you to do the opposite. I, don't push, suck it back in. What? Yeah, did you know that today it's illegal to have babies? Wh why? Uh, it's a new law. Whatever baby's born today, we have to send it into space. It, they, they, NASA puts it on a spaceship and sends it to Pluto. Oh, no! Can you believe this? The government don't want us having mixed babies. Yeah, that's, yep, that, that's what it is. So if you have a baby today, they're going to send it to Pluto. So you better just keep it sucked up. But, but I'm in so much pain. Come on, baby. You can hold it. You can hold it for one more day. Yeah, your baby's going to be in a lot of pain when they send him to Pluto. Yeah, yeah. We don't want that. Okay. Yeah, so just hold it till March 1st. Okay, I'll try for the baby. Yeah, just keep it. Hold it in. Hold it in. Yeah, just keep doing that. 
Oh, I can't hold it anymore. Come on, baby, just hold it a little bit longer. A couple more hours. You just hold it for a few more hours. Oh, I can't. Come on, baby. All right, I'm back. A doctor, I can't hold it anymore. All right, let me take a look. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. Now hold on. All right, there's something fishy going on here. What? That's a balloon. Well, a balloon? Yeah, help me get this balloon out. Well, a balloon? What? What? Is she had a balloon in her shirt? You, you're not even pregnant. You're just faking. Judith, what's going on here? Oh, Tyrone, I have a confession to make. I can't really get pregnant. Wait, what? You can't get pregnant? I told you I wanted to have a baby. I know, but I thought you'd be mad, so I just hid a balloon in my shirt for the last nine months. So how are we going to have a kid that can hopefully get successful so we can live off of this money? Well, you guys could just adopt. Adopt? Yeah, you know, just adopt a kid. Hmm, I guess we could adopt a kid. I mean, I wouldn't have to pay child support since he's not mine, right? But I don't know. What do I look adopted? I have no idea. But yeah, you should adopt a kid. Oh, God, Tyrone, let's adopt a kid. An exotic one. Oh, okay, we can do that, baby. Oh, come on. <laughs> let's go get an exotic kid. She wasn't pregnant. Cody. Your mom wasn't actually pregnant. Wait, Junior, that's impossible. This is my birthday. Maybe we got the date wrong or something. Well, no, 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 Cody. What if you're adopted? Wait, Junior, I'm not adopted. I look just like my parents. What, you do? Well, yeah. I mean, well, I look like my mom. You know, I, I have her, you know, like her, her, um... Well, like, I look like my dad. You know, how he has that... And I, I kind of... look. Junior, I'm adopted. Yeah, I'm adopted. That actually explains a lot now that I'm thinking about it. So who's your real parents? Well, Junior, I have no idea. My, my whole life has been a lie. But you're adopted? Yeah. Uh... Well, we should go back to my house because I want to play with my squishy Chuck E. Cheese head. Uh, oh, okay, yeah, but um, I I'm out of change. Oh, I, I found a quarter in my pocket. Uh, oh, great. Yeah, so um, l let's go. Okay. Make the noises, Cody. Oh. Pew, 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 Oh, yeah, my squishy Chuck E. Cheese head. Look how squishy, Cody. It's pretty squishy, Junior. What's wrong, Cody? You're acting like you found out you're adopted or something. I did find out I was adopted. No kidding. Junior, you were the one who told me. Is that right? Junior, you have the memory of a goldfish. Cody, who cares if you're adopted or even born in the first place? All that matters is you're here now. Thanks a lot, Junior. That really helps. You know, I wish my parents had told me that I was adopted. It's just that they hid it so well. Where's my adopted orphan son at? Hi, Dad. Look, I've been looking for your orphan butt everywhere. Dad, am I adopted? <sighs> adopted is a strong word, son, okay? But, Dad, who are my real parents? I am your real father, and I will whoop you like your real father if you don't get back to the house and blow out the candles on your adoption day cake. Yes, sir. Well, Cody, when are we going to find out who your real parents are? Oh, we'll find out someday, Junior. Like next episode on Dragon Ball Z. All right, Cody, you can just go home. Okay. Happy 12th birthday. Man, L12, I swear to God, if I see the pins again, oh, I will... Plumber versus home spa clog. Oh my oh. gosh. Time to get clogging. The Is this sink, sink? clogged. Look oh, at that. Man. She's about to oh go. My. Oh, oh. Damn. Attention all passengers, your flight has been canceled. The plane is on fire. We will refund you all your money. Junior, go to sleep. It's midnight. Come on, shut up. But Chef PB, the plane's on fire. Well, they're not going to be able to board the plane, Junior, because it's on fire. Unless the fire truck comes to save the day. Junior, shut up. No, no, that fire truck has to go. But, but they're going to put the fire out, Chef PB. No, they're not. Well, so you want them to board the plane with it on fire? Sure, sure. Whatever makes you go to sleep faster. All right, guys. Board the plane. I know it's on fire, but Chevy B wants you to board the plane. So get on the plane. <sighs> oh, yeah, we're going down. But show you, what are you doing? The plane crashed. It was on fire. Well, if it was on fire, it should have never taken off. Exactly, but you stopped the fire truck. Oh, my God, Julia, just go to bed. Who's that? I don't know. Hopefully, it's a kidnapper. Go and open the door. Uh, okay. 
idiot. Uh, hello? Hey, Junior! Hey, guys! What are you doing here so late? Well, me and Joseph were wondering if, if you, you wanted, wanted to have a sleepover! A sleepover? Yeah! No! What? Why would I want to have a sleepover with you losers? Losers! Ha <laughs> ha! Just kidding! I wouldn't do that to you guys! Oh, okay. Yeah, you haven't seen my new bed! Uh, ooh, new okay. bed? I wanna see that. Yeah. Dude, I don't even have a bed. I sleep on dirt. It's actually soft, way comfortable than concrete. Uh, 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 okay. well, well, come on inside. See my new bed! Yeah. Okay, dude! Alright, guys, check out my new bed! Whoa, you have a bunk bed? That's sick, dude! Junior! Oh, no! No way! Tell your friends to go home! I'm trying to go to sleep here! Whoa, Junior, you share a bunk bed with Chef Pee Pee? Yeah, it sucks. Junior, did you not hear what I just said? Tell your friends to leave! Shut up, bottom bunk! <gasps> what did you call me? That's right, you're bottom bunk. I'm top bunk. I make all the rules, so shut up! Oh my god, this is reminding me of the orphanage all over again! Alright, guys, get up on here. <laughs> well, you better not make too much noise! I'm trying to go to sleep! <laughs> Alright, guys, what do you think about my new bunk bed? It's cool, I guess. Oh, oh, dude, it's so bouncy! Right? It's so bouncy! Yeah! <laughs> yeah! It's so bouncy! <laughs> Junior, stop jumping up and down in that bed! You're gonna break it! Shut up, Chef Pee-Pee. The only way this bed would break is if Cody's mom was up here. <laughs> Cause she's fat. <laughs> yeah. Wait, what? Uh, Joseph, I bet you a dollar you won't stick your head in that ceiling fan. Show me the money. What, uh, Cody, you have a dollar? Yup. <sighs> okay. Oh, dude, that's a bed. What? Junior Joseph's head came off! That's sick! Well, yeah, it was pretty gnarly. Do you think he's okay? Junior, he lost his head for a dollar. We should probably call a doctor. <sighs> Let's ask Chef and see what he says. He is the adult. <laughs> Joseph's head! It's right there! There's no body! Where's his body? Oh my god! Hey, Chef Pee uh, Joseph's missing his head. I can see that! <laughs> well, Cody said we should call the doctor. Do you think we should call the doctor? <laughs> Duh! What do you mean, Junior? Duh! Call the doctor right now! Okay, but I didn't hear you say, please. <laughs> Please! Please call the doctor! There's a hand in my bed! Okay, that rhymed, Dr. Seuss. <laughs> hey, somebody call the doctor? Whoa, what happened here? Uh, my friend's missing his head. Yeah, I can see that. How'd that happen? Well, Cody paid him a dollar to stick his head in the ceiling fan. Wait, no, Junior, you paid him. Where'd I get the dollar from? <sighs> Me. So you funded the whole operation. You're guilty. Look, I don't really care who funded it. I'm just more worried about this headless kid right here. Well, uh, do you think you can fix him? Uh, I'm gonna be honest with you, no, I don't. Well, I have this double-sided tape. Uh, okay, fine. Yeah, I guess I can give it a shot. Uh, uh, voila! Good as new. Dude, I feel weird. Uh, you put his head on backwards. Oh, did I? Well, just be glad his head's even on his shoulders. Uh, Joseph, you feel okay? Uh, no, dude, I don't feel too good. I think I'm gonna go home. I'm out of here, dude! Uh, wrong way, Joseph. Oh, oh yeah, uh, uh, I gotta figure this out. At least it'll be easier to wipe. <laughs> I'm out of here, guys! <laughs>